One of the first, the most important uh, factors that we wanted to include in the program was the participation of the private sector. So from the initial uh, call for proposals, we wanted to assure that the private sector was participating with the training institutions so that the training offered would be relevant. So we worked with, we asked that in the proposal there would be commitments by, signed commitments by the private companies to uh, determine what were the training needs of that company and that they would have a place to offer for an intern after they would be trained in the classroom. So this was one of the ways to assure that the training was relevant to the market needs. Another one was we wanted to assure that the, the training also met the needs but through assessment of the labor market. So we asked also for a, a mini labor assessment uh, to assure that the labor markets were dynamic, to see what kind of sectors were growing in this field, to understand a bit uh, uh, better whether the training that will be offered would be relevant. So this was one of the, the challenges that we faced and it was difficult because at the beginning we saw that even though they had committed prior to in the proposal, we saw that the companies at times did not fulfill their commitments to have the intern, so we had to think of different mechanisms to assure that this link between the training in the classroom and the training internship was kept between the private sector. And here we, uh, made, uh, we made an effort to work with the employers so that they would work in the curriculum of the training so that they c felt that they were still working, that they were still participating in the whole program so that when they got to getting the intern interns, it was not a surprise and they would not have disappeared by that time.